Hello, Zamlon Fallsteller. Hello, collectors and trappers all over the world. I'm just back from a, a short vacation in the northern parts of the Netherlands, and I want to show you some uh, pictures of the flea markets over there, and I will show you a, a little video from the shore, from the coastline of this part of the Netherlands. And uh, please listen. Yeah, that's the noise everybody likes to hear, I guess. That's the noise, it's uh, reassuring for everybody of us, I think. What do you mean? And now I will show you some uh, some little film of some pictures of the uh, flea markets over there. Film dollars van hem. Heb je toestemming? Darf ik dat niet? Dat darf man in Holland niet, hè? Darf man niet? Oh, oké. Okay. Well, now we want to make, uh, or I want to make another break, and I will show you some strange cattle for this part of the northern parts of the Netherlands. But this uh, kind of uh, cattle is still there, and they are grazing in the waste, uh, in the waste dune area to clean this area up. They are mostly eating grasses and, and something like that, and they can. Uh, live there as if they are in an open range. So let's have a look. Am 27. Mai 2022 auf dem Weg zum äh, Flohmarkt Dunkel 9 in äh, Den Helder. Kleine Pause. In the Netherlands, the first uh, tool I want to show is this rasp. 
a little bit rusty but it's uh, really sharp it's really really sharp and it's uh, made uh, from a from a com company in the Netherlands I hope you can read it uh, yeah. Nicholson Aha. You can read it. Nicholson, a crossword or something like that, and a marking Holland. It seems to be very good. And then I bought some new ratchet screwdrivers. This is with a marking. I guess it's Stanley, but there is a, you can read, um, Shira, uh, Spira looks, Spira looks made in England, model number seven, uh, seven one three zero, I guess. And this uh, screwdriver is in a really good shape. The second one I bought, I think this is an older one. It's made in Germany. There's the marking, you can read Western Germany, made in Western, not, there's not standing, uh, you cannot read made in Western Germany, it's only Western Germany. But this, uh, you, uh, you have only one uh, one blade, but it works too. The third one is this one. No bits inside, and uh, this is from Germany. Uh, Nail. This is made in USA, pattern number 5053797 and this one is in a really good shape and it works too. Another one I bought, this is Black & Decker. Black and Decker, Turkey, right or left, and you can switch this. Another nice screwdriver, ratchet screwdriver. The fifth is this one. This one has no markings. but it has bits inside look at this isn't that this is lovely great to see some bits inside and the last ratchet screwdriver is this one. This one is from made in England, England, but uh, no company. I can know I cannot read any company. It's only stamped on made in England. Maybe Stanley or something like that, I don't know. And also some bits inside wonderful and then i bought a 
a Beko spanner, 6 inch of 150 millimeters with a number 8, is it 8 or 3? 8070. And this one is in a really good shape. Look at that. Wonderful. I paid not much money for this tool. And then I got this here. A Stanley number 199A. I will restore it sometimes. I don't know if I have the time. <laughs> but here, here is my favorite. My favorite. My sleeping beauty. Look at this. This is my sleeping beauty. This old screwdriver I will try to restore and I will uh, probably bend it here, make the bend it out and then I will show you my restoration of this little sleeping beauty. What do you think? Is it possible to restore this screwdriver or not? Thanks for watching.